Hi, I'm Aroysius. My team and I will be talking to you about our engineering exploration project known as the vending machine system. We have myself, Shane, Amir and Jasmine who will join us later. And we are from K2. Our team came up with a driving question for our project. So, our driving question is the claiming design a system that minimizes the workload for the vending machine bag. Our project introduction this project aims to minimize the fees that the workload of carry and other other of vending Some vending machines do not provide any value, therefore, the vendor is effectively realizing the amount of stock left for the vending this very question system will provide the data of the smart to the system through a display value. In addition, this project has the keys if an RFID sensor to ease the mode of unlocking the system. Now I'll be sharing with you what we bought from our recent backup. When, vending machine, when the vending machine is out of stock, it's not easy for an operator to switch gears and handle requests right away as he wants to track several accounts logistically. Broad cases can be common, especially when customers uh, devise ways of hacking the system of the machine to dispense product by inserting foreign objects into the machine or abusing the machine itself. I have not talked about the functionalities of the of our project. So firstly, the first step by step is used to display the amount of items left, the dots it doesn't go for the of the machine. It also controls the door when the vendor is opening and it sends the amount of items left to amputate the to the second by step which will also display the amount of items left on the screen. A server motor is used to control the opening and closing of the door when opening. Both the RGB is used to as an indicator for whether there's any items left in the vending machine. The PIR would be used for the low power mode when no one is detected. The machine will go to low power mode in LGB number one and turning off all the sensors. If movement is detected, you have returned to normal operation, turning on all the sensors and allowing RGB1 to be tracked to correctness. The Q of F is used to sense the amount of items left in the vending machine and the RFID is used as a replacement for the key when the vendor is refilling the products. Hope you enjoyed this short presentation and thank you for your kind attention.